All right, so uh, I'm here with DJ Doc. Uh, we're at Black Hospital. We wanted to, we were asked to comment on an issue that happened today regarding COVID. Uh, a man walked in. Uh, he was taken to the hospital by me, transported in my ambulance. He was taken to Ward A, uh, where he underwent. Uh, he, he was revived by our defibrillators, and then he underwent some slight surgery. And when the man was, uh, when he woke up, he was coughing and throwing up, and he was getting migraines. And he was just complaining about how bad his head hurt. And uh, DJ James administered a COVID rapid test, and it came back positive. And uh, I'll, like, I'll let DJ, uh, DJ James go into detail about what he did. Yeah. So we were able to, you know, it tested positive. So we were instantly on lockdown mode initially as soon as we started hearing him complaining. We hit the alarm button to, you know, lock all the doors. We had three people outside at the moment. And we instantly, as soon as we were able to, you know, calm down his symptoms and, you know, get his migraine to stop going away and all that stuff, we, I, I issued the man to go, you know, stay wearing a mask and, you know, to come back every three days so when no one's around so we can check up how he's doing. And he's going to be at issued home rest to make sure the spread does not continue. This is the first confirmed case that we have so far in this state of San Andreas. Uh, well, in this city, of course. But uh, we really don't, you know, we haven't seen anyone else with the same symptoms. We have cleaned the whole building. We've obviously changed our outfits, even though it doesn't seem like it. We have spare clothes at all times. Uh, I'm pretty sure Huggle was able to clean, uh, what is it, his ambulance after transporting him. Yep. Yes. We, we have, uh, we have, uh, Structures have been cleaned. Everything's been cleaned. We're, we're now wearing masks. Me and DJ James are going to wear masks for the Doc. next few days. Me and DJ Doc are going to wear masks <laughs> for the next few days because we were in contact with that man. And uh, we want the people to know that we are working closely between each other to make sure this does not spread to anybody else. Yeah. And uh, we want you guys to know that you're safe and uh, everything is under control currently. Yeah. And then if you do have any symptoms to make sure to come by and we could, you know, we could do some like drive through tests to make sure to see if you have it or not because you know if you do feel like you have any symptoms that instantly come because we do not want you to you know have what this man just had to go through awesome. obviously we want to keep our uh, safe and uh that, that's it from us at Phil Black's hospital